All right, here's the yard. Um, now to give y'all an idea as to how big these places are. Now this is a large yard. Let me move back. Some. We're gonna do a little bit of yard tidying up. No, we're out. But that's the yard. There's the grass. Hi, Tom. Say hi. Oh, you driving? Headed out. Go ahead, town. Okay. Behind that lattice uh, is about another section as big as this. Um, like I say, she's got a large yard. Uh, back there by those trees, that's actually a park. But, uh, yeah. There's a fence. Neighbor's house. There's a fence. Neighbor's yard. Little bitty. We'll cut that grass. Maybe today or tomorrow. Do a little bit of yard work. Get the boys out. and Give her a little bit of help. I don't know if you can see it or not. Let's zoom in. She's got a nice little apple tree. Let's get you a view of the other side, huh? It's nice out today. I'm actually in a uh, tent top. There's her place. A neighbor's place. More neighbors. And more neighbors. But, uh, that's a cool little sundial. I like that last time I was here. But yeah, um, I'm not sure what time it is right now. I got up late. I didn't need to catch up on sleep for like the past month. So, I went ahead and did that this morning. Um, but, uh, yeah, uh, we're gonna get a few things done. I need to go out, find a travel agency, get some cash exchanged, and pick up a few things. Everything's close. We'll just walk. But, um, just want to let you know how my morning's going. Been pretty good. Calm. Okay, so we're going to the yard, which we got to do a little work out here. Look, she got her apple tree. His neighbor's yard over there. Okay. So. That's the end of the yard. But, my wife used to spend her young days coming back here because I've got him a nice little field with a little park in it. I mean, kids love it, so. Yeah, a lot of fond memories here for my wife, anyhow. I guess these guys now think you can, sir. Shutting us in. Oh, shutting Sean out. You're not going to let him in? No weirdos. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> you going sliding? It's wet, Tom. No. You can you can do this by yourself. Cause it got springs. <laughs> <laughs> Automatic seesaw, huh? Everyone to Katie one. Tom's going to jump on a crazy squirrel. Try to. He's going to ride his side saddle. <laughs> Tom, give him this for me. 
Well, that's good. I'm surprised you didn't land on your head. That's the heaviest part on you. Giant melons. All right. Well, we're going to do a little bit of playing out here. Give the woman a break. Maybe she can get a nap in. And, uh... You too bad. I want to show you all this. I was impressed with this last time. I don't know if y'all got any around where you live. Not this. I mean, that's not terrible, but that's a good idea here. Okay, so you got your chain on it, right? Well, then it goes in to a piece of pipe. Daddy, straight pipe. And it really helps. Plus, the kids can't swing it around the top. Dad, I want you to push me. All right, well, I'm going to push him. Okay. There. It's bringing back memories. <laughs> Little Brit with a turtle attached to her belly. It's Joe on a rope. It's orange. I was probably about Tom's age when they put this park in. So I was about three, maybe four. <laughs> Man, it's held up good over all those years. <laughs> I mean, wow. And we didn't just come down here to play on the swings and the side and stuff. We would get our imagination going. And Daddy? <laughs> and out. They're hogging all the swings. That's a baby swing. Um, I was in it. It fits perfectly. He's a big baby. I got Hold stuck on. in it. When we were kids, there I used to be a it. show on TV called Gladiators. And it was like an obstacle course and you had a gladiator coming after you. Oh. Well, we used to play our own version here on the park. And you, and you had to climb along the swings, swing off the bar here. Climb along this these swings, swing off the bar, then you'd go up the slide, down the ladder, climb on the seesaw and walk across it, sit on the rocking horse and have to rock ten times, run to the bench, climb on the bench, run across it and touch the gate, all before the person tagged you. <laughs> <laughs> Go Gladiators! <laughs> oh yeah, that's not 80s. That's a drag. 90s. Uh -huh. Hey mom, that's not a drag. How do, Tom? That's not a drag. Hey, 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 that's not a drag. You don't keep calling that a dragon. That is a squirrel. Six. That is the tamest looking dragon I've ever seen. Uh, eight. Oh, yeah. You're supposed to have somebody chasing after you. Where's my dragon? Play gladiator. <laughs> See that, folks? Dragon. Wait, where am I supposed to go now? Touch the gate. I already touched him. No, leave me be and let me ride my dragon. Squirrel. It's a dragon. It used to English be a horse. dragon. It's a dragon. English dragon, American squirrel. <laughs> yes. No. This is her woods. Now, when we first moved here, you see the blue in between the trees? Let's see if we can zoom in on that. Right in there. That's actually... That's a factory. Yeah, that's a factory. Now, when we first moved here, that wasn't there, and it was all fields. You could see way, way down into the next town. That's a long factory. It goes way down there. Well, yeah, then when factory. we was probably about 10 is when they built the factory there. So, yes, that's our woods. <laughs> that's their woods. She upgraded. That's I why did. she married me. She wanted bigger Yay. woods. <laughs> Not some that you can throw a rock through. Now, this was the spot that me and my friends used to play a lot around. And uh, in all these trees and bushes, we'd build dens and play all kind of things. <laughs> We're just going to check out if the pond is still here. Keep on going. So 
this used to be the pond that we would all play down at and catch frogs but as you can see it's all overgrown now <laughs> but we would spend hours playing down here one of our favorite things was climbing trees too <laughs> catch the dad <laughs> Well, yeah, walking around down here don't half bring back a ton of happy memories. All the times we would play gladiators or tag, or over here we call it tig, <laughs> uh, fox and hounds. All the kids on the, all the neighbourhood kids on the street, we would all get together and come down here and play. Sometimes we even camp out, so. Yeah, it's pretty wild to see some things have changed so much and then others haven't. <laughs> We got the whole gang plus Auntie Katie and even Nevy. Come on, Tom! Here it is, Christ the King, our old school. <laughs> so here we are walking the hallways of my old school and Wow, if I thought the park brought back a lot of memories, this really does. I absolutely love this school. Um, just everything about it. And there's the classrooms. And, oh. <laughs> it's so strange, but it's so cool. It really is a lovely school. It was when we were here and it still is now. And, now that Scarlet and Neve are here. Down the hallway to the next lot of classrooms. And here's house points that they do with the class. And that used to be my house points. I used to be in St. Francis. This is the main hall and I remember um, this was where we would have our lunch <laughs> and it's also where we would have PE as well and that cross up there that cross of, yeah, that cross of Jesus is the same cross that was here when I was at school here and it's still up there. <laughs> this is a playground I used to play on and it didn't used to have that climbing stuff over there. That looks good. I remember that. That forest bit down there, actually my year, I think it was either the second to last year or my last year, we were the ones that cleared that for the like nature reserve. But it's still there. And then all the weeping willers. We used to love going under the weeping willers down there, especially on a hot day. 
and rolling down the hill. That was that was something we enjoyed doing too. Yeah, it might seem a bit weird filming a door, but this used to be the girls' bathroom and there used to be a story that there was a ghost that was in it called Peggy Lantern. And we never really saw anything, but it's just one of those stories that was passed from generation down to generation at school. <laughs> I don't think Kelly quite knows what to make of being in Scarlet's class. What do you think? Ha, ha, ha. 